What's up quarter pounders? Welcome back to my channel. My name's Wave Potter, and today I have a reaction clipped from one of my past live streams, so please enjoy. Kick it down. Yayoka just put out a new video last night that I haven't had time to watch yet, but I figured I'd slip it into the beginning of the stream because I really want to see it. Cool. It is a rush cover of YYZ. Very so, cool. So, I mean, I'm pretty sure everyone here knows that song. She made a cover of this like two years ago, I think. Okay. And why is this one different than that one? Because it's... A, she covered it recently. Okay. So it's this just was shot March 9th, 2022. A new and improved version. Yeah, okay. I would guess. I haven't seen it yet. So I'm really excited to check it out. And it's, I think, yeah, it was live at the Cube Garden in Sapporo, Japan. Live in a bar with the whole band there. So yeah, Yayoka on drums, Madun, her aunt on bass, Holy on keys, Yoshihiro Sukahara on guitar, and Kenji Narum Narumi on guitar. And then Aki did the sound. So cool. cool. You ready for this? I'm very ready for it. Ooh, she's doing alternating hands for this. Wow, that was really clever how she counted between those parts so they all came in at the same time. It's a trick, you know, Bonham used for Black Dog with the weird timing, and that worked out really well. But I gotta say first, before I get to that really complex part there, that intro is surprisingly difficult to play because you start out with your hands on the accent beats, the dun dun, how's it go again? Dun, 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 dun. Like your your hands are both doing that, but then they switch to where um, your left hand is keeping the beat, a steady beat, and your snare hand is syncopated with that. So it's kind of it's a complicated thing to wrap your head around while you're playing it. And that was just so smooth. All right. I wish I could see my Dune a little better because this bass line is so insane. Getty is just all over the place during this song. I hope you can see her during the little solo. Wow, nailed it. The thing that makes this the most impressive to me is that it's live. So it's all one take. Mm -hmm. All five instru uh, people or four or five people playing are having to do one take all together and nail it. So impressive. <laughs>
such a hard lick right there. It goes all over the neck. But dang, my dude can shred. Again, playing this song on just three toms instead of the, you know, 15 that Neil Peart would have had. <laughs> like the asterism cover we watched a couple weeks ago. Interesting. Vladimir says, I know this song f only from an asterism cover. That is fascinating. I thought this was like a rock and roll classic right here. <laughs> Yeah, well said, Vladimir. For me as a drummer, I kind of see this song as a rite of passage for crossing up to, like, advanced level drummer, you know? Yeah. Like, this and Tom Sawyer are, like, the Rush songs that you want to learn as a drummer. Huh. At least that's the way I see it. Mm -hmm. That ride pattern. The way those fills Peart did there cross over too to incorporate the hi hat on the offbeat with the left hand, that is so cool this and is just glossed the over. The most excited I've seen you all week. <laughs> I know. Well, that's because I've been passed out on the couch for three days and everything was terrible. It's so nice to see you alive. I know. This is the first time I've had joy in three years. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. <laughs> Cute. Dude, that was really tight for a live one take version. Really cool. I just had to watch that to get things started tonight of course. because you know, I saw it pop up last night. I was still feeling pretty terrible. I couldn't just, uh, I wanted to film my reaction to it the first time I watched it, and I couldn't just go film because I was like so stuffed up and stuff. But anyway, awesome. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to pound like and also subscribe and turn on all notifications so you know when I put out new videos. If you'd like your requests featured in the live streams, you can always visit my website down below and make a request for that. Or you can support the channel on Patreon and get access to a lot of Patreon exclusive reactions. And there's also options for making reaction requests over there. But anyway, thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you next time.